Say something first, Mom. Testing, testing. Testing, okay, there we go. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Christine and today we are going to be sharing with you a much needed Daiso haul, but this time I have a special guest, my mom. <laughs> Say hi, hi, mom. <laughs> hi, everyone. Many of you guys requested that we film another Daiso haul video together, so I really encouraged my mom to, you know, just to be in the video this time and she gladly agreed. Well, she kind of had her arm twisted <laughs> to film the it's video. It's more like arm twisting, but yes. anyway, um, here I am. Christine and I went to Daiso, and I think it's been a year since I went there shopping. And um, I also realized that I seem to be buying almost the same things that I used to buy, except that every time you go back there, it's a different version of what of the same item. If you guys aren't aware of what Daiso is, it's basically the Asian version of a dollar store. Everything or mostly everything is a dollar fifty unless otherwise marked. It's either uh, three dollars, four dollars, five dollars, seven dollars. It just really depends. But it is a really really cute, dainty. Um, Asian version of a dollar store. Daiso added a lot of newer items this time, which I was really surprised with, right? Mm -hmm. like, yeah, they added a lot more uh, new stock of items, so we wanted to share with you guys the things that we purchased. Some of the stuff are gonna be repeats, but a lot of the stuff are new items. Okay, so one of the first things I purchased are these Toast Deco stamps. So, I don't know, I just thought they were so cute. I mean, it has this little smiley face that says delicious, and this one, with a sunshine and it says good morning. I just thought it'd be cute because I always need to have my one slice of toast in the morning with black coffee. Heat resistant glassware. I have exactly, not exactly, but very similar to what I purchased in another dollar store. But um, I couldn't resist it because it was only $1.50. So it, this one is square and this one is rectangular for leftovers. Rectangular or square boxes are space savers in your refrigerator. So if you guys watched my previous Daiso haul, you saw that I purchased this little tea infuser, which I do not recommend because if you guys have loose tea leaves, they will float out of here. I ended up seeing these uh, by mistake and they are these uh, silicone tea infuser fruits. The best thing about it is that it's silicone and hopefully the tea leaves will not go through these and then the other one is shaped like a lemon. As I mentioned earlier, I seem to be purchasing the same items. Anyway, I have two pairs of slippers. One is uh, an outdoor slipper. Very cute. It has its... Um, what's this? Pink laces. <laughs> I have yeah. pink uh, shoelaces. And, and then this is um, bathroom slippers, uh, which I will use after shower, after getting out of the shower. So you guys know about my hair journey and yeah, my co the color of my hair is a little bit different now. So I went ahead and purchased this pack of shower caps, disposable shower caps. I guess there are different, I don't know how many are in here. I'm guessing maybe like a pack of 10 for $1.50, blue, yellow, and pink. A hair mm -hmm. coloring capes. Oh. Because I've been going through, you know, just like your old shirt that you use for dyeing your hair. Mm -hmm. I've been going through them like crazy, so it's a dollar fifty, and it will be of good use. My grandson will probably like this. It's um, made of soy and uh, spicy fried rice crackers. And another one which I always purchase anywhere. There is uh, chestnut. It's a chestnut Japanese style, ready to eat. These little tiny Q-tips. These are the individually wrapped baby uh, Q-tips, uh, which you guys know we absolutely love. We always stock up on these. Makeup pads, 160 count. Cosmetic pads, because I always seem to purchase the ones from Target. I think it's like two something, but this one has a lot more. And the best thing about these is that the edges are already kind of sewn together mm. so it doesn't fall apart. I will let you guys know if I like them or not. I mean, only $1.50 for 160 pieces. Another item that I seem to be always purchasing are rubber gloves. 
but I noticed these are the most durable in the market today the other time I bought a small size so uh, this one I made sure it was at least a large size gas range mat first time I'm going to use these mats usually I would just cut out the aluminum foil and cut it in the middle and so I'm trying to make it easy on myself this flexible mini straw 100 pieces they're each, each individually wrapped and I like these because they're the type that you use for juice boxes but as you guys know I like to put or use a straw when I'm drinking coffee or when I'm drinking tea so I thought these would be perfect they're a lot smaller than the regular size straws for work I'm always using mm -hmm. the disposable spoon fork and knives which is such a waste even if you recycle it but I got this little uh, three-piece set with a case comes with a spoon, a fork, and also chopsticks, chopsticks. And a, a little container. Laundry net. Exactly the same. I bought this last year, I believe, and it's really, really useful, especially for the delicate, the delicate clothes uh, tops that you, you want to preserve. So I highly recommend this. Kitchen sponge, another variation. A little bit thicker and the color is white and black so something different I think it's this is more durable these poor care packs they're the no strips love these things for a dollar fifty pack of four and this is actually for my husband it's called the collapsible cup I just thought he could make use of this somehow it has a little clip thingy here you can attach it because my husband's um, big on fishing and then how do you pull this apart? So you just pull it apart and there you go. You yeah. have your collapsible cup. Now, when we came home, we were surprised that we each bought this cup. And uh, when I saw this, it reminded me of my childhood in the 50s. <laughs> and that cup was very popular during our time. We would use it for juice, for water. I'm glad it came back. My mother gave me a mirror that could stand up by itself. Uh, uh, the size is, sim is almost the same as this one, but I broke the mirror probably 15 years ago. And since it had a sentimental value to me, I didn't throw it away. And I said, I'm going to look for a mirror that will fit the one that my mother gave. And somehow I know this will fit. It's not the same size, but I know this will fit last two items this one is uh, something that you stick onto your shower so that you can put your you can put your soap the only difference here is that there are big holes in it so that any um, drippings will fall on the tub instead of sticking around this item and last but not the least i have a iphone 5 i just wanted to protect the the bottom of the iPhone and see how it works. It's a sticker. It sticks on the iPhone. It's a really large pack of Pocky. Um, this one is the cookies and cream flavor. It's actually pretty good. This was $4 and it came with, I believe, nine packs of these. They're, mm. they're pretty good. So if you guys see these, I recommend them. The last three items are actually for work because I'm one of the only people in my little row that doesn't have good candy at their desk so I purchased this little cute little pink pig and then inside I'm going to just fill it with these individually wrapped haichu candy this one's the tropical mix which is banana mango and melon mm. and this one is the original with strawberry grape and green apple mm. that is everything we wanted to share with you guys for our Daiso haul we hope you guys enjoyed the video Mom, as much as we enjoyed showing them to you Yes, <laughs> I know. I well, I think my mom did an amazing job at uh, you know filming, and I'm really I'm very happy that she agreed to film the Daiso haul with me. Don't forget to give this video a big like if you guys enjoyed it, and also give this video a big like because my mom was in the video with me. Don't forget to subscribe, uh, follow me on all my social media. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, we love you guys so much, and we'll see you in our next video. Mwah.